guys so today we are going to see that how we can do our mock test analysis and believe you me it is a very very simple process so it won't take much time so number one let's take an example maan lije aapne ek mock test diya jisme 100 questions the you attempted 80 of them you left 20 of them unattempted ab jo 80 aapne questions attempt kare usme se you were able to uh, score 60 like basically aapke 60 questions sahi hue and you did the remaining 20 questions wrong so the first and the foremost step in a mock test analysis is to figure out that wo jo 20 question hamare galat hue unme se aise kitne question the jo hame aate the fir bhi humne galat kar diye maybe because of some calculation mistake or some other random silly mistake maan lete hain wo question 10 hai to sabse pehle hame yahi karna hai mock test analysis mein unko identify karna hai unko kahin likh kar rakh lijiye kyunki wo questions hamare galat nahi hone chahiye the hame unme score karna tha and hame agle mock test se yahi try karna hai ki wo 10 questions ka number dheere dheere kam hota jaye Point number two, बाकी जो 10 question हमने गलत करे हमें उनमें देखना है कि हमारी क्या गलती थी हमने questions attempt करे that means कि हमें वो आता था chapter हमें उसकी practice थी हमें वो confident enough कि हम वो सही कर पाएंगे but still अगर वो गलत हुए that means कि कहीं ना कहीं conceptual error था या फिर हमें गलत formula याद हो गया या फिर हमने apply गलत ढंग से करा तो second point हमें यही करना है second step is that कि वो questions जो हमें आते हुए भी हमने गलत करे हमें सबसे पहले तो identify करनी है that what was our mistake and why did it happen और फिर उसको हमें solve करना है हो सकता है उसके लिए आपको solved examples देखने पड़े किसी book में से या फिर आपको practice करने पड़े या concepts को brush करना पड़े तो वो हमें identify करना है ये दोनों चीजें बहुत जरूरी हैं and इसके बाद third step आता है कि वो जो twenty questions हमने unattempted छोड़े थे what was the reason for us to leave them so right तो maybe हमने वो chapter नहीं पढ़े थे इसलिए हमने unattempted छोड़ दिए या फिर we were not sure कि for example, in a question, there are two options in a question. That's why we have left it like this, like blank. So, in the third step, we have to analyze it and then see what we can do in it. If we haven't read the chapter, if there is such a question, then we have to read the chapter. If we had a doubt in any two options, we have left the question unattempted or blank. So, we have to see why the doubt came. Maybe I didn't read it before, and what is the correct answer? So, basically, this is a three-step process. And it's a very simple thing. And if you will do this, it will not take a lot of time. It seems like it takes a lot of time. But we can do the whole analysis in 1-1 hour. Just divide all the questions, categorize them into three categories as I have told you. And the most important category is our first category, which we have done silly mistake or calculation mistake. We can reduce the amount of time, that is the best. Because then our score will be optimized. We can do something from unattempted questions. We can do something that we have done wrong, we can do something that we have done wrong. But if we are wrong, if we are wrong, then that can be really really detrimental for our final score. Okay, I hope you would have got something really valuable out of this video. If you are new, please subscribe it. Share it with your friends and don't forget to hit the like button before going. Let's meet in the next video. Stay home, stay happy, stay safe.